Hey, and welcome back to DKW. Tonight is going to be the final match between Combat Joe and Matthew Forsaken. Coming out first, we got Combat Joe. He's got his bat with him. These two have been going at it for quite some time now. KW Champion, Matthew Forsaken. Now in case if anyone hasn't been up to date on everything, DKW has been challenged by IMF. And Forsaken is going up against Omen Black. And that will be a tables match. If Omen Black wins that tables match, he will get a shot at the DK Dub World Championship. Combat Joe also has a match. He'll be taking on Dirty Donnie Johnson. Look forward to seeing those matches here in March. Alright, let's get this thing underway. Reps in the ring. guys this is it this is the final one and they tie up forsaken definitely overpowers combat joe oh throws him in the rope leap frogs him combat joe with an arm drag We've got forsaken down on the ground now We've got that arm drenched oh, drops into an arm bar Forsaken fights, battles his way over, he's on top. They're scrambling on the bottom from Combat Joe here. Oh, wait, Forsaken picks up Joe. He's going to, he's going to Forsake. Nope, here comes. It's just a takeover. Nice, nice counter. Combat Joe gets better and better every time he steps in the ring. Forsaken makes his way back to his feet. Combat Joe takes Forsaken almost completely out of the ring. Oh, he's going to stop it. He's all the way out of Yeah, he's going to get him out of there. Combat Joe gets a little break, catches breath. He wants to try to play a little bit smarter this time and get that title back. Ooh, dives to the ropes, takes out. Matthew Forsaken with a dive. Combat Joe has gotten crazier and crazier. Every match with Forsaken has pushed that man further and further into sanity. Forsaken rolls her back in the ring. Combat Joe comes in, clubs him in the back. Combat Joe picks up Forsaken. Irish whip off the ropes. Big drop kick. Beautiful drop kick from Combat Joe. That was straight to the face of Matthew Forsaken. The ref was counting them both down. Combat Joe must have landed a little awkward on his back there. Knocked the wind out of him. He's a little slow to his feet as is Forsaken. They're both up. Ooh, crossbody to the corner. And that knocks all the air out of Forsaken. Combat Joe back to his feet. He's lining up for another shot. Big knee. Right to the jaw of Forsaken. Forsaken's down in the corner. And here comes Combat Joe. Sets him up. Boom, cannonball in the corner. Forsaken's taking a beating right now. Can the DK Dub Champ hold on to the belt? Combat Joe's slowly getting back to his feet. Forsaken beats him back to his feet, but he's still in the corner. Combat Joe grabs Forsaken. 
chucks him in the corner. Face person a turnbuckle. Looks like Joe's setting him up for another knee. Is he gonna get him with another knee? Yep. High knee right to the chin. It's gotta be combat Joe's one of one of Combat Joe's favorite moves is that high knee. And a nice suplex. Combat Joe looks like he's getting tired really quick. He just blew his load in the first four or five minutes of this match. He's got to get a breather. And there's a counter from Forsaken. Combat Joe into the corner. Big European uppercut for Forsaken. Combat Joe slunched over in a corner. There's a knee from Forsaken. Forsaken takes advantage. He puts Combat Joe up on the top turnbuckle. What's he going to do? Ooh, chop. Oh, another chop. Just listen to it. And he climbs it up in the top turnbuckle. Oh, Combat Joe chucks Forsaken down to the mat. What's this? Combat Joe. He's on that middle turnbuckle. What did he say? Coffin drop. That was interesting. He just chucked all his weight down on his opponent. You're a smaller guy. Use all your body weight, right? The rest starts to count. Yeah, that, was, that was a nice move on Combat Joe, but I'm sure it hurt him a little bit too. Combat Joe. Ooh. Baseball slide drop kick takes Combat Forsaken out. Combat Joe's back to his feet. Stomps on Forsaken. He picks Forsaken up. Chucks him out of the ring. Now he's climbing to the top. Now things are getting crazier and crazier. The balls on Combat Joe will grow every match with Forsaken. Here he goes off the top rope. Superman Punch takes out Forsaken from the top rope. Both men moving slowly right now. As the ref continues to count, Joe's back in the ring. is a Forsaken Rules match for those who don't know. The only rules in Forsaken Rules are the count outs and also the 10 count for the knockout. And there's a chair shot from Forsaken. Combat Joe got too cocky, too confident. Matthew Forsaken has a chair waiting for him as he dives through the ropes. Oh, Forsaken's just chucking chairs into the ring. Over the ref's head. Oh, just chucking them in the ring. Oh, there's another one. That's three chairs. What's he need three chairs for? chairs he sets up a chair table this is one of Forsaken's favorite things is the chair table ooh just stomps Combat Joe in the head stomps him in the head again trying to help Combat Joe. Joe's tossed back back in the ring. Forsaken. He's picking him 
them up. They're right in front of that chair table. He's gonna set him up. Nope, what's he doing? Scoops up. He's got a fisherman. Nice. Ooh, into a pin. One, two. He kicks out. Combat Joe still has a little bit of life left in him. Ooh, Forsaken's getting frustrated, stomping on his head. Oh no, he's just unloading on Combat Joe right now. He just flipped the bird to the ref. Forsaken is in that dark place. Combat Joe. Somebody needs to help. Just chucks him into the corner. Oh, he's going to set up for the Forsaken Bomb. Got him up. Oh, Combat Joe starts wailing on his head and drops Forsaken. Combat Joe's fighting for his life. Just diving and punching as he crawls towards Forsaken. Stomping on Forsaken. Combat Joe grabs Forsaken's barbed wire chair. He winds up, bam, straight to the head. Oh, Forsaken. He just got hit in the head by his own barbed wire chair. Combat Joe is out for blood. Combat Joe is definitely hurting. His energy level is so much lower. He thinks he has this. You gotta go pin him. Joe, you got to go get him. You have to pin him. Wait. Nope, the ref says he's okay. Forsaken makes his way back into the ring. Oh, Combat Joe stops him. Starts wailing on him. And there's a back chop from Forsaken. Forsaken fights back. He still hasn't made it back into the ring. Okay, he's back in the ring. Oh, and he meets it. Boot. Chop. Chop. We got a battle. Ooh, that chop took Combat Joe down. Forsaken egg and Imani saying, bring it. Oh. Let me go again. Oh. Ooh, you can hear him. Oh, they just, they had enough. They're just going. Forsaken smashes Combat Joe. Elbow drop. Forsaken picks up Combat Joe. Oof. Here comes the chair. Oh, right across the back. Satan's talking shit. He's winding up for another chair shot. Oh, straight to the head. Oh, Combat Joe rolls out of the ring. He can't get pinned on the outside. Smart move by Combat Joe, but he he took a chair shot straight to the head. Forsaken goes back to that chair table again. He has it set up. Combat Joe is less experienced. More pain he's ever felt. Oh, man. You heard that. Forsaken goes out. He grabs Combat Joe. No, he pushes the ref out of the way. He's just doing his job, Forsaken. Starts wailing. Starts wailing on Combat Joe.
Forsaken throws Joe back in the ring. Forsaken follows him back in. Picks up Joe. Joe's fighting back. Pushes Forsaken in the corner. Forsaken starts wailing. They're fighting in the corner. Combat Joe, he's got the upper hand. He unloads on Forsaken. He's setting up Forsaken. There's the chair table. Suplex through the chair table. Ooh. Swear every time Forsaken sets that chair table up, he ends up going through it. Maybe he shouldn't do it anymore. He should probably stay away from the chairs. The rep checks on him. Make sure they're both okay. Is he going to start the count? Oh, well, Joe's back. Back to his feet. Glad to see they're both okay. They're both crazy. Oh, another chair shot. That one took Forsaken's head off. The only thing the ref can do is sit there and watch. He's there for the count, that's it. The ref's trying to get a break for Forsaken. Looks like Forsaken's bleeding. He's been busted open. Says he wants to continue. Combat Joe's right back on Forsaken. Pulls him back up to the ring. Needs to get him in the ring. Here he goes. He got a suplex back into the ring. Joe should have just went for the pin. But he's just picking him back up. He's choking him. He's got his wristband and he's choking him. Combat Joe's choking Forsaken with the wristband. Forsaken has made Combat Joe turn to dirty tactics to try to win this match. Understand it's forsaken rules, but that's dirty. You use your wristband to choke some man, that's dirty. Combat Joe's trying to catch his breath. He can hardly stand. Forsaken's making his way back up. And there he is. He catches Combat Joe. Big overhand. Starts wailing on him. Throws him in the corner. Chop. And another one. Oh. Snap mirror. And an elbow drop. Could this be it for Combat Joe? Is his time up. Ooh. Both these men are tired and beaten down. Uh oh. Looks like that chair, the chairs were being set up for something here. Forsaken's crazy mental ass. What's he doing? DDT. Oh. That was just a car wreck. Both men are uh, no wait. Forsaken makes his way back up. Is he going for the pin? No. Picks Joe up. Gonna back suplex. Nope. Joe counters, flips out, lands on his feet. Another big drop kick. Looks like uh, who's Forsaken may have hit his head on the chair on his way down. Both men have rolled to the apron. 
Combat Joe is out of the side of the ring, runs over and just kicks Forsaken in the side of the head. Starts stomping on him on the apron. Rolls him out of the ring. Oh, they're going towards the announce table. We can't ever get a break over here. Tearing up, there goes my water too. Oh jeez. Hey, now you're throwing the ref. Picks up Forsaken. Sets him on the table. The ref's telling him to get back in the ring. They don't care. The ref's begging for him to get in the ring. He's setting him up on the table. Here we go. Swanton through the table. Damn. Both men down. The ref don't even know what to do. He's really only there to count, I guess. Combat Joe makes his way to his feet first. Oh, he definitely felt that. Forsaken's moving. Combat Joe grabs the DK Dub World title. That's not yours yet. Signifying he's going to end this. Ooh, just smashed Forsaken with his own title. Taunt me. Stands over him with his own belt. The wind up smashed him again. Forsaken's laid out flat. Taunting and rubbing the belt on his open wound. Combat Joe has just gone to unnecessary extents to win this match. Combat Joe throws Forsaken back in the ring. I think it's time to end it. You should be trying to pin him. That's how you win the title. Joe has forsaken. Off the rope. Ducks the clothesline. Ooh, kicks him in the gut. Combat Joe has forsaken. Forsaken pushes Combat Joe. Oh, there's Big Larry. Give him a well needed breather right there. Forsaken is rocking back and forth. He may be getting back to his feet first. But he took Combat Joe's head off with that lariat. Starts stomping Joe. Looks like Forsaken has a second win. He got a chair. Ooh, knee. Right to the side of the head, taking Joe out. Mulls Joe onto the chair. No. He just scoops him up, slams him on the chair. Oh, we know what this is. Forsaken up for the moonsault. Combat Joe stretched out on that chair. Forsake. Oh! Connects with the moonsault. He didn't pin him. He didn't pin him. Signified for the demon cutter. Sets him up. 
And there it is. Boom on the chair. Demon cutter on the chair. Now it's over. Wait. No. He picks him back up. Looks like the forsaken bomb. And got him up. And it's over. It's done. Two. Three. That's it. It's over. They can retain the title. There it is. Now, when he faces uh, Omen Black, March 14th, in that tables match, Omen gets a shot at that title. Black is ready. If Forsaken does something to you. Thank you for joining us. Please subscribe.